televisions, Dementites and Dementoids. This is Dr. Demento, your host for the MTV Demented Top 20 Countdown. Over the next two hours, I'll be showing you videos so unusual, so bizarre, they'll make you question whether there is any order to the universe. Demento, and since my regular gig is on the radio, I just had to throw in one video with a radio motif. Here's Stan Ridgeway and Wall of Voodoo with Mexican Radio. on the demented top 20. And although Stan Ridgway has gone on to solo work since fronting the band, the rest of the wall still stands, carrying on the voodoo video tradition. Stay where you are, we got lots more blither idiocy on the way! Well, me and my friends love Larry and Mo. We love Curly's brother Shep and his fat clone Joe. It's such a delight to boogie and hustle, dancing all night doing the Curly Shuffle. Ooh. 
Welcome back to the Demented Top 20 Countdown. I'm Dr. Demento. You know, a lot of people in music spend their time supporting causes, like Amnesty International or anti-nuclear groups. And our next group is no exception. It's Camper Van Beethoven. And they've taken up a cause that not many artists would dare to. Here they are with their socially conscientious song, Take the Skin Hint Over. Camper Van Beethoven would take the skinheads bowling in at number 17 on MTV's Demented Top 20 Countdown. The group was originally a California garage band, and that song is from their debut album, Telephone Free Landslide Victory, which also features the backwards version of Stairway to Heaven in Morse code. Yes, that's true musicianship. Up next, a group from Greenwich, England, who started out with the songs, uh, The Druids Are Coming and uh, The Goats Are Trying to Kill Me, making them instant candidates for our demented top 20. This one is from their album, Happy But Twisted. Here's Doctor and the Medics with Bernard. Give me Mark. a B. Give me a U. Give me an R. Oh. Give me an N. Yeah. What's that spell? What's that spell?
and the medics with burning love. A favorite among asylum patients and politicians everywhere. I love the doctor's half Elvis, half Eddie Munster look. Right now, though, I'd like to show a bit of a classic video by the great granddaddy of d medded music, Spike Jones. Way back in the 40s, he was doing music videos with a d medded flair, although back then they called them soundies. This is from Clink Clink Another Drink, and it features Spike as the bartender and the voice of Bugs Bunny and Friends, the one and only Mel Blank on Hiccups. Clink, clink, no more to drink. I had a cellar full, but now it's gone. Clink, clink, the glasses clink. Like the anvil chorus and my head is splitty, freaky, busty, oh brother. group is part of the new generation of offbeat artists. They're called They Might Be Giants, but they're really just two guys named John from Brooklyn who have a decidedly different outlook on life. Here's their video, Don't Let Start, at number 15. Don't, don't, don't let start. This is the worst part. The belief for all the world that you are my precious little girl But don't, don't, don't let's start I've got a weak heart and I don't get around How you get around When you are alone, you are the cat, you are the bone You are an animal The words I'm singing now mean nothing more than me Smell the cat food in your bank account But don't try to stop the pill that wax the hound D-world destruction over an overture And do I need a bus to redeem me this Dutch giant Don, don, don't let start, this is the worst part Could believe for all the world that you're my precious little girl But don, don, don't let start, I've got a weak heart And I don't get around, how you get around They want what they're not, and I wish they would stop saying "dabba da 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 ding dang dabba da 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 ding dang da 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 If you want to hear more of They Might Be Giants, they have their own dial-a-song phone line where you can call up and listen to one of their latest inventions. It's 718-387-6962. Back to our demented countdown at number 14. It's a song with a much different flavor. This one reminds me of an old-time movie musical. In fact, I expect to see Carmen Miranda coming around the corner any second. It's Kid Creole and the Coconuts with Endicott.
o'clock And the gods giving it all they got And the gods job is six to nine And the gods home by nine or five And the gods helps to cook the steak And the gods helps to wash the plates And the gods puts the kids to bed And the gods reads a book to them Why can't you be like Endicott? And the gods loves Tribina's soul And the gods put her on a pedestal And the gods wishes her command But and the gods don't make no demands And the gods always back in time And the gods not the cheating kind And the gods full of compliments And the gods such a gentleman Number 14, that's Kid Creole and the Coconuts with Endicott. Unfortunately for Kid, two of his coconuts just split and joined up with Billy Idol's official girlfriend, Perry Lister, to form the group Boomerang. Up next, a video loaded with puns, but not just any puns. No, no, that would merely make it clever, but not demented. These puns are about vegetables. That's why comedian Kip Adata is number 13 on the demented top 20 countdown with life in the Slaw Lane. It was cucumber the first. Summer was over. I had just finished a long day and I was bushled. I'm the kind of guy that works hard for his salary, and I don't mind telling you I was feeling a bit wilted. But I didn't care at all, because otherwise things were fine. I try never to disparagus, and I don't sweat the truffles. I'm outstanding in my field, and I know that something good will turn up eventually. A bunch of things were going great, and soon I'd be top banana. At least that's my appealing. But that's enough corn. Lend me your ear, and let us continue. After dressing, I stalked over the grain station. I got there just in time to catch the 9-11 as it plowed towards the core of Appleton, a lentil more than a melon and a half east of Cloveland. Got 
off at Zucchini, so we continued on our route to Bega. Passing my usual stop, I got off at Cado. I hailed a passing yellow cabbage and told the driver to cart me off to Brooklyn. I was going to meet my brother across from the eggplant, where he had a job at the Saffron Station Pumpkin Gas. Well, as soon as I saw his face, I knew he was an EM. He told me his wife had been raising cane. Her name was Peaches, a soiled but radishing beauty with huge gourds. My brother had always been a chestnut, but I could never figure out why she picked him. He was a skinny little string bean who'd always suffered from cerebral parsley. It was in our roots. Sure, we tried to weed it out, but the problem still remained. He was used to having a tough row to hoe, but it irrigated me to see Artie choke, and it bothered my brother to see his marriage go to seed. Like most mapled couples, they had a lot of growing to do. Sure, they'd sown their wild oats, but just barley, if you please. Finally, Peaches had given him an ultimato. She said, I'm hip to your chive, and if you don't stop smoking that herb, I'm gonna leave you for basil, you fruit. He said he didn't realize it had come quite so far. On the other hand, even though Peaches could be the pits, I knew she'd never call the fuzz. My little story is okra now. Maybe it's small potatoes, me, Idaho. My name, wheat. My friends call me Colonel, and that's life in the slaw lane. Thank you so much. It's a garden out there. Life in the Slaw Lane, our number 13 video on the Demented Countdown. More weirdos, <coughs> freaks, and video misfits coming up in just a minute. Welcome back to MTV's Demented <laughs> Top 20 Countdown. Up next is not the weirdest video or song by any means, but it's definitely a bit of a novelty. Hank Williams Jr. is one of the all-time great country artists, so when he wanted to put together a fun song with some of his artist friends, he got quite a turnout. There are more cameos in this than We Are the World, including uh, Willie Nelson, Chris Christopherson, Waylon Jennings, Cheech and Chong, Leon Redbone, well, you'll see. Here's all my rowdy friends at number 12. Hey, 
are coming over tonight Just walk through the door Got a little whirlpool Just made for ten And you can jump out And you can jump in You can do anything That you want to do But uh -uh, don't you step on my cowboy boots They're coming over tonight. Hank Williams, Jr., and a cast of thousands with all my rowdy friends. And just in case you thought that we were getting too mellow here on the Demented Top 20 Countdown, or that strange videos only come out of swamps down south, our next video takes dementia into the rap era. Here are the surf MCs with their pleasant little ultimatum, surf or die.
Surf MCs with Surf or Die, our number 11 warped video on the Team Headed Top 20 countdown. We'll be back with the top 10 most demented videos we could find after this. Well, me and my friends love Larry and Mo. We love Curly's brother Shemp and his fat clone Joe. It's such a delight to boogie and hustle, dancing all night doing the Curly Shuffle. Welcome back to the Demented Top 20 Countdown. Before we get into the top 10, I want to play another Demented Extra video from the infamous Spud Heads and the yellow jumpsuits and plastic hair who totally confused the Western world in the late 70s. I'm talking about Devo. And for this video, they donned a different wardrobe. In beaks and feathers, here they are with love without anger. Love is what 
Welcome back to the Demented Top 20 Countdown. I'm your host, Dr. Demento, and we're moving into the top 10 most twisted, most off the wall, and just plain strange videos in the entire galaxy. Up next is a group who just had a top 40 hit with a song, Pop Goes the World. It's Men Without Hats, who first broke on the scene in 1983 with this top five song, Safety Dance. And what is a safety dance? Why are there dwarves in the video? Well, it's a demented countdown. You're not supposed to ask logical questions. We can dance if we want to. We can leave your friends behind. Cause your friends don't dance. And if they don't dance, well, they're no friends of mine. We can go where we want to, places so they will never find. And we can act like we come from out of this world, leave the real one far behind. We can go and we want to, night is young and so am I. And we can dress real neat from our hearts to our feet, and surprise them with a victory cry. We can act if we want to If we don't, nobody will And you can act real rude and totally removed And I can act like an imbecile I say, we can dance, we can dance Everything's out of control We can dance, we can dance We're doing it from all to all We can dance, we can dance Everybody look at your hands We can dance, we can dance Everybody's taking the chance Dance. Oh, it's safe to dance. Yes, it's safe to dance. We can dance if we want to. We've got all your life in mind. As long as we abuse it, we're never gonna lose it. Everything will work out right. I say we can dance if we want to. We can leave your friends behind Because your friends don't dance And if they don't dance, well, they're no friends of mine I see We can dance, we can dance Everything's out of control But We can dance, we can dance We're doing it from pole to pole But We can dance, we can dance Everybody look at your hands But We can dance, but we can dance Everybody's making a chance Dance Who will save the dance? Yes, it's safe to dance. Oh, it's safe to dance. Oh, it's safe to dance. Yes, it's safe to dance. It's safe to dance. Yeah. Oh, it's safe to dance. It's safe to dance. Oh, it's safe to dance. Oh, it's safe to dance. Oh, it's safe to dance. Men without hats there with Safety Dance, starring their lead singer who calls himself uh, Simply Ivan. Uh, not Simply Ivan, just Ivan. Uh, uh, you know what I mean. Next up is Utopia. Now, lead singer Todd Rundgren has often shown a sense of humor in his music, but uh, this is one of the rare moments when he got demented with his whole band. With Todd as the lead caterpillar, of course, here's Utopia and Feats Don't Fail Me Now at number nine.
was not the Buggles. That was Utopia with Feats Don't Fail Me Now with lead bug Todd Rundgren. Our next video <laughs> is about a family named Blattidae. No, they aren't French royalty. That's the family of insects that we call roaches. Bobby, Jimmy, and the Critters must not have been living on Park Avenue when they thought up this song. So continuing the creepy crawly bug motif, here they are with their parody of the Club Nouveau song, Rumors. It just keeps getting worse and worse as we move towards number one on the Demented Top 20 countdown. Stay tuned.
the d Medic Top 20 Countdown. Up next at number seven is a group that you know better as the Young Ones. They've become a staple of Sunday Night Madness on MTV, but they also like to experiment, so they put together a band called Bad News that's a demented version of a heavy metal group. Kind of along the lines of Spinal Tap, though actually Bad News thought of it first. Here they are with their version of the Queen classic Bohemian Rap. I thought that was I good. That was pretty good. Yes, I thought it was very good. Like Queen on stage. Yes, absolutely. And there you had the guys from the Young Ones as their alter egos, the heavy metal parody band Bad News with Bohemian Rhapsody. And if you're a fan of Bad News, there is a movie about them called More Bad News and an episode of the British comic strip also features Bad News on the road. They've even released an album in England. Our number six video comes from former B-52's leader, Fred Schneider, who sang lead on such notable oddities as Rock Lobster, as well as playing toy piano and walkie-talkie on other tracks. But with his solo work, Fred really pushed the limits of sanity, putting out this one in at number six, Monster. Everybody starts to 
Fred Schneider, formerly of the B-52s, with Monster, the number six most demented video on our countdown. Fred, by the way, does have some scruples. You see, he was originally a forestry major in college, but when they asked him to cut down a tree, he refused and became a journalism major. And that was only the sixth most demented video on our countdown. Where do you see what's coming up in the top five? Welcome back to the Demented Top 20 Countdown. We're about to show you the top five weirdest videos in the world. But before we get to them, I want to highlight one more Demented Video Extra. It's the comedy duo Cheech and Chong, who've put out a slew of warped albums, films, and videos. But this is one of my favorites. With their parody of Bruce Springsteen, here's Born in East L.A. Nothing more. So answer in English, you 
if you can. Where were you born, man? Huh? Where was I born? That's right. I said, where were you born? Hey, are you one of those dudes that do horoscopes, man? Hey, I'm a cancer with a bad moon rising. Look here, Elfago. Watch my lips. Where were you born? I was born in East L.A., man. I was born in East L.A. Oh, yeah, you're born in East L.A. Well, let's see your green card, huh? Green card? I'm from East L.A. All right, well, then who's president of the United States? Oh, that's easy, man. That guy that used to be on Death Valley days, uh, John Wayne. All right, let's go. Come on. Listen, I know I'm in a foreign land. People talking so fast I couldn't understand. There was nobody there to lend a helping hand. I was told it was not where is a burger stand. I want to go back to East L.A. I wish I was back in East L.A. Cheech and Chong, born in East L.A., a demented extra on MTV's demented Top 20 Countdown. Now let's kick off the Top 5, the Funny Five as I like to call them, with a video tribute to one of the most brilliant and demented comedians of all time, Curly Howard of the Three Stooges. The group honoring him is a bar band from Chicago called Jump and Saddle, who mostly played good time rock and roll, but found themselves with a hit on their hands when they put out this novelty tune. Here they are with the Curly Shuffle. When me and my friends go out in the town, we can't sit still, 
we can sit down. We don't like to fight and we don't like to scuffle, but we dance all night doing the curly shuffle. Hey mo, hey mo, hey mo, hey mo. Well, uh, yuck, 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 Curly's brother Shemp and his fat clone Joe. It's such a delight to boogie and hustle, dancing all night doing the curly shuffle. Hey mo, hey mo, hey mo, hey mo. Well, uh, yuck, 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 yuck. Comedy classics on late night TV. Those knuckleheads love to get in a scuffle. They push and they shove, doing the curly shuffle. Hey mo, hey mo, hey mo, hey mo. Well, uh, yuck, 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 yuck. Look at the grouse, look at the grouse, look at the grouse, look at the grouse. <laughs> well, we never miss a chance. We get up and dance and do the curly shuffle. That's right, we do the curly shuffle. What'd you say? That was Jump in the Saddle with a curly shuffle at number five on the demented top 20 countdown. This next guy is one you've all become familiar with recently. Mojo Nixon was one of our co-hosts down in Daytona, and he and his buddy Skid Roper have been putting out demented tunes for quite a few years now. Their titles include such classics as Burn Down the Malls, I'm Living with a Three-Foot Antichrist, and Stuffin' Martha's Muffin, which was a backhanded tribute of sorts to MTV's own Martha Quinn. But their current hit and our number four most demented video is a tribute to the king himself, Elvis is everywhere. I came across the cloud, and uh, well, it really looks like Elvis. When I look out into your eyes out there, when I look out into your faces, you know what I see? I see a little bit of Elvis in each and every one of you out there. Let me tell you, well, Elvis is in Nutty Buddies. Elvis is in your mom. He's in everybody. He's in the young, the old, the fat, the skinny, the white, the black, the brown, and the blue. People got Elvis in them, too. Elvis is in everybody out there. Everybody's got Elvis in them. Everybody except one person, that is. Yeah, one person. The evil opposite of Elvis. The anti-Elvis. Anti-Elvis got no Elvis in them, let me tell you. Michael J. Fox has no Elvis in him. Uh-uh. Yeah, and Elvis is in Joan Rivers, but he's trying to get out, man. He's trying to get out. Listen up, Joni, baby. Elvis is everywhere. i 
phenomenon out there in the world. A lot of things people say, what the heck's going on? Let me tell ya. Who built the pyramid? Elvis! Who built Stonehenge? Elvis! Yeah, maybe see guys walking down the street, pushing shopping carts, and you think they're talking to Allah, or talking to themselves, man, no, they're talking to Elvis! 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 You know what's going on that Bermuda Triangle? Down the Bermuda Triangle. Elvis needs boats. Elvis needs boats. Elvis, 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 Elvis needs boats. Ah, the sailing Elvis, Captain Elvis, Commodore Elvis it is. Yeah, man, you know, people from outer space, people from outer space, they come up to me, they don't look like Dr. Spock, they don't look like Klingons, all that Star Trek job, they look like Elvis. Elvis! Everybody in outer space looks like Elvis, because Elvis is a perfect being. We're all moving in perfect peace and harmony towards Elvisness. Soon all will become Elvis. Everything, everywhere will be Elvis. Why do you think they call it evolution anyway? It's really Elvis Lucian. Elvis Lucian. Elvis is everywhere. was Mojo Nixon on guitar and Skid Roper on the washboard with Elvis is Everywhere, our number four video on the demented top 20 countdown. And just when you thought it was safe to watch MTV, we have the top three most demented videos on earth coming your way! Welcome back to the Demented Countdown. We're down to the three top videos, or maybe I should say up to the three lowest of the low. It starts off with someone you've seen a lot of here on MTV, known as the other Julie Brown. She's been a stand-up comedian and singer for quite a while. Here she is to introduce our number three video on the Demented Countdown. Guess what? We have one of my videos from my record, Trapped in the Body of a White Girl, coming up. It's the song and the video, The Homecoming Queen's Got a Gun, which is about one of my best friends in high school, Debbie. We expected big things from Debbie, but I don't know, she kind of surprised us all. <laughs> <laughs> it was homecoming night at my high school. Everyone was there. It was totally Split my seams Cause my best friend Debbie Was homecoming queen She looks so pretty In pink chiffon Riding the float with her tiara on Holding a humongous bouquet in her hand She looks straight out of Disneyland You know what the Cinderella ride? I mean definitely an e-ticket
You wouldn't believe what they brought to stop her. Tear gas, machine guns, even a chopper. Daddy didn't listen to what the cops said. She aimed and fired, and now the math teacher's dead. I was really sad, but kind of a relief. I mean, we had this big test coming up next week. Everybody run. The homecoming queen's got a gun. Everybody run. <laughs> the unsinkable Julie Brown with her cult classic Homecoming Queen's Got a Gun at number three on the demanded top 20. And by the way, you can also find that one in its splendid audio version on the 80s edition of Dr. Demento Presents the Greatest Novelty Records of All Time. <laughs> well, Dementides and Dementoids, keep your straitjacket tightly wrapped because the number one most demented video is on the way. Time now for the grand unveiling, the number one video on the demented top 20 countdown. Back in 1979, the pre-dawn of MTV, some people were still ambitious enough to make offbeat short films with music. This one ended up on Saturday Night Live and was seen in some of the hipper movie theaters. It features actor Bill Paxton, who's now in the group Martini Ranch, and I'm even in there without my top hat. The group is Barnes and Barnes, which is Bill Moomy, the former star of Lost in Space, and Robert Hamer, who plays keyboards and sing. The inexplicable song they created is called Fish Heads, our number one most demented video.
fish heads in the evening, floating in the soup. Fish heads, fish heads, roly poly fish heads, fish heads, fish heads, eat them up, yum. Ask a fish head anything you want to, they won't answer, they They don't play drums. Roly poly fish heads are never seen drinking cappuccino in Italian restaurants with Oriental women. Number one video on MTV's Top 20 D-Minute Countdown, Fish Heads by Barnes and Barnes. Don't look to me for explanations. I just play the videos. <laughs> but I do know that Barnes and Barnes have also just completed working on a spoken word record with Crispin Glover, the actor from River's Edge and Back to the Future. Well, that's it for our show. Thanks for joining me. And if you'd like a printed transcript of the Demented Top 20 Countdown, you can write to Bill Moyer's journal. But... <laughs> I don't think you'll know what you're talking about. Until we meet again, put your sheep underground, keep your fleece in the jars, or something like that. Don't forget to stay demented! You're the one who said I love you too. Didn't you know? Blue.